What's up everyone and thank you for stopping by the channel. Today's project is this Troy built XP trimmer and the problem is that while being used the engine wants to slowly rotate on the shaft till it's practically upside down. Let's take a good look at it, find out what's wrong with it and hopefully we can fix it. In this video we try and repair this trimmer, however it may not be the exact repair you need to make to yours, we'll explore other options later in the video. This is a pretty decent trimmer for the price, but this one had a really tough life. After using this trimmer for a few minutes, the engine will turn itself upside down, which doesn't sound like a big deal until you take a good look at it. Now you could keep using this, but it would be really annoying after a while. If you try and turn the engine the right way, it won't stay that way for long, and it's best if we fix it. I have another trimmer that's very similar to this one, so let's take a good look at it and see if we can see any differences between the two. If we focus where the shaft meets the engine, you can see a couple of screws, one in the center of the shaft and one off center, which is a clamp that grabs the shaft. The center one is just a set screw. However, if we look at our trimmer, we can see that there's only one screw, the off center one, so that means our set screw is missing. To fix this problem, all we need to do is loosen the clamp screw so we can rotate the engine on the shaft and then replace the set screw. Now we could replace the set screw with any random screw, but I don't want to destroy the existing threads. Instead, I'll take the set screw from the other trimmer, which has a bad engine and will not be rebuilt anytime soon. Now, if you do replace it with a different one, even with the same threads, make sure it's a short screw. Otherwise, it may go too far and make contact with the drive shaft. Also, try not to over tighten the screw, otherwise you'll damage the threads. After we install the set screw, we can now tighten the clamp screw. Now we shouldn't have any problems after doing this, but let's start the engine and make sure it still runs. Another reason why your engine would spin upside down while running is if all the screws that keep everything straight were loose. It's a good idea to check that all your screws are not loose once in a while. So my question is, what would you do if your trimmer screws kept coming loose because they were damaged? And in the end, the trimmer head or the engine kept getting misaligned with one another. Would you try and fix it or would you just buy another trimmer to replace it? I know what I would do, but I'm more interested in your answer. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate your time. Please feel free to ask any questions, and I hope to see you again in the next video.